Well, being rural dean involves a number of different things, I guess. I mean, one of the things that appeals to me about it is uh, being having some sort of oversight of what's going on in other parishes in the deanery, and being able to uh, meet with fellow clergy and uh, support them, and uh, sort of care for them and uh, find out what's going on, and hopefully be able to sort of tie things together and uh, inform people of uh, what might be going on at a diocesan level and things like that. Uh, one of the things uh, involved in being rural dean is working with the bishops and the archdeacons, and obviously at the moment it's rolling out the diocesan strategy and making sure that all parishes are aware of uh, what exactly is entailed in that and what we need to be doing at any particular point and keeping it very much on people's agenda and uh, so that they can see how what they do on a parish level uh, very much ties in with what's going on on a diocesan level. Yeah, I think the strategy is a good thing. Uh, know, love and follow Jesus. I think that's great. And I like the way that it's broken up into sort of manageable chunks. And so this year, for example, we're thinking about the year of mercy. And what's particularly helpful is for each parish to be looking at one thing that they can do to bless their local community. What I like about that is that it's manageable. Um, you know, too often we can be sort of phased with loads of things that need to be done. But when we think of one thing that focuses our minds, focuses our thoughts, and when we met as a uh, deanery synod, we were thinking very much uh, and really stressing the point, it's not what we can't do, it's what we can do. And sometimes you might look around and think, well, that church is bigger than us, and they've got these people, and they've got more money. And you feel a bit uh, demotivated and wonder where you can start. But if you think of what you can do, even if you're a small bunch of people, uh, there's something that everybody can do, and it's working out what that is. So at the beginning of this new year, I think it's exciting for every parish across the diocese to be thinking about this one thing that they can do to really bless their local community. And what I like about that is it's uh, manageable, it's one thing to focus on that can keep our focus for the whole year, and it's going to be exciting to see how that is worked out and in what different ways we're able to reach out to people and share the good news uh, of Jesus with them.